I'm not very flexible. Like I'm trying to touch my toes right now, and this is That's pretty a much it. That's a good drop there, to that, be honest. Exactly. So, you know. Cut me some slack yeah. here. here. Thank you for that. Congratulations on this film. Thank you. What an iconic role to take on. This is insane. Man. Yeah. I'm so overwhelmed by all this. No, no, look at all these people. <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah. What are they all doing here? Go home, guys. <laughs> they want to see you. They want to oh, wow. see the film. Isn't that great? Yeah. But it's a really, really, really special night. It's like again, we shot the movie here, so. Um, like, I'm, I'm trying to find all my friends that were behind the camera that we haven't seen during the press tour. You know, my Eddie, my driver is here somewhere, and, and like our makeup team, and it's I'm incredibly excited for tonight. I guess it's really special to share it with them. But, um, it's very, very special because they were obviously, you know, key people, and they were there for six, seven months with us. So, um, and it's been a month of traveling around the world, but just like with David and the actors, and who cares about them? It's all about Eddie, the driver, you know, yeah, exactly. I love him, I love him. You should, you should bring him up to do the interviews with I you. will, actually, if I see him. He's incredibly charming. Aww. You like him, yeah. I have uh, to say, David was just telling me that you were actually just stood on, like, you know, random locations around the UK, and then they just made it look like it's Africa. So were you a little bit disappointed that you didn't get to go on a nice... I tried to go now to Gabon, where we, so we shot uh, plate shot for six weeks in Gabon. So what you see in the movie in the background isn't painted. It's, I mean, it's like real locations in Africa, in Gabon. Um, and I tried to go down there, but I shot, I was wrapping up True Blood up until the day before we started prep here in London. So we tried to get me to London and Warner Brothers tried to squeeze it in between True Blood and prep for this, but there was no way of going. But I get to go to the Amazon in two weeks. You're going to be swinging? Uh, I'll definitely find some vines out there, uh, but it's, I'm so excited. I'm going to go like deep into the Amazon for a week and spend some time with the indigenous people out there, and oh, I can't wait. Amazing! Is that yeah. just, a, just a holiday? Um, it's with Greenpeace for a, for a, for a project out there. So how? What does it take to become Tarzan, though? Like how can you swing through some uh, vines now? Would you say? Oh you man, I it was a lot of training and a lot of. Uh, I'm not very flexible. Like I'm trying to touch my toes right now. This is so pretty much it. There's a drop there, to be that, honest. Exactly. So, you know. Cut me some slack yeah. here. here. <laughs> Thank you for that. Uh, but I, it, yeah, no, it was. Um, I had to. It was important. I wanted to put on some weight and get a little bit bigger. But it was also important that when he's back in the jungle again, the movie opens in London when he's Lord Greystoke, and then he reverts to a more animalistic state. And when he's back in London uh, in the jungle, it was important that he's um, athletic and not just big and you know so I had to work a lot on being becoming a bit flexible and nimble so you lost that, it all now. that was a interesting challenge and I've yes the day we wrapped I was like no I'm done <laughs>